Hey everyone, this is Sally, back with another mini album that I just completed. This is a 6x6, totally chipboard album. Every page is chipboard, and it's done with the duct tape binding. Uh, it's an okay method for me, but I still prefer my Bulky Bliss method because... Uh, the bulky bliss lays flat, whereas this you just really have to hold it. So, you know, it's it's still a great album though. It's I love the fact that it's thick chipboard. Uh, it's really nice. So, anyway, I made this one, believe it or not, with no lace, no flowers, nothing really feminine in the album. Because I know that Father's Day is not too far off. This would be great for Father's Day, uh, a gift for your hubby, your dad, your grandfather. Uh, it's just it's a really cool album. And uh, let me show you the inside. I've used on the outside, I've used the stencils that I've been buying from Saw Crafters. Her uh, store is on um, Zibit, I believe is the name of it. Anyway, um, I'll try to put the link to Saw Crafters channel and to her store. She's got some really cool stencils, and I haven't seen these stencils anywhere uh, on Zibit, you know, except Saw Crafters. And uh, if you haven't had a chance to see even her any of her videos, you need to go do that. She's really talented. I love to watch her. I love to hear her talk. I love her voice. And uh, she's just the sweetest thing ever, and she is very talented. I have learned a lot from watching her videos, but I love this brick stencil, and I've used the texture paste on that. So this has a, a dimensional effect here. Papers are really gorgeous, and for this little album, I have used the uh, Recollection Regent Street paper stack. So inside, uh, if you have seen my 12 by 12 album that I made, um, Tatter Time. All of the photos are hidden, and this one is made on that same method as my 12x12 12 12 Tatter Time mini album. All of the photo mats just lift for your photos on the inside. Now on this one, I did on the Tatter Time, I embellished the outside of every flap, but on this one, I just added some uh, little tags and things with these adorable little Tim Holtz hanger clips. And these can be removed, of course, and a photo added. So every page will hold three photos, uh, you know, one on the outside of the flap and two on the inside. So that gives you, uh, see, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Is that right? Uh, so that gives you a lot of photos, ladies. Uh, this one, another little tag is clipped on there. It says memories. And there's the inside. I'll show you the inside. This one is really uh, different for me without any flowers or lace or anything. But I do love the way it turned out. Really. Even though it seems simple, the papers are pretty and it's very elegant. And there's a lot of people that don't like all the frou-frou. I'm finally getting that picture. <laughs> I've had so many of my customers request items that don't have so much lace and things on it. I just love the lace, though. Can't help it. I like trim and lots of embellies. And I have just loaded some more embellies in my Etsy store, ladies. Some handmade things. So if you're interested in... Uh, getting some handmade things, just pop over to my Etsy shop, scrapbookgiggles.etsy.com to find that. But here's the front again. I love it. This is a, a Jolie's 3D embellishment here with the clock and the key. And it actually has a little chain. Really cool. Love it. Uh, oh, I will be stamping the back. I forgot to do that. It will be stamped with this handmade stamp with my name written there all right ladies thanks for watching thanks for all your comments and all your continued support love you guys